just uh, popping in to remind you to subscribe if you like what we do. Hit that little bell to be alerted to us posting stuff, I think. And leave a comment. Feedback in this stage of the channel is very useful and helpful. Also, if you want to help us get bigger, tell a friend, tell them to subscribe. Thanks, and enjoy the video! Welcome back, Mortal Stone, to another episode of Oh look, I found my sister! Uh, welcome back to Wrong Door Plays Fable, Boss's favorite game. As I and just struggle through it. I'm Andith, and this is Bus. Say hi, Bus. Hi, Bus. Uh, yeah, so it's been a little while since we played this game, so I gotta remember what the fuck I'm sure. doing. I don't know why you have these two people following oh, you. But... I just thought, I realized that I have the ability to make people follow me, so I decided that I was gonna take this lady and this gentleman. Actually, I don't know why this gentleman is following me. Uh, I was actually trying to fart at them, and they just happened to like me. Wait, is this where- this looks very similar to where I grew up. Yeah, it, it's the same place you grew up. Oh. I remember you. We thought you died in oh. that awful bandit raid all those years ago. You look like my friend so I just brought in here. all this time? Um, clutching my head, confused. What? You do remember me, don't you? Oh God! I was looking for Rosie, my teddy bear, just before the raid. Your After voice didn't change day, at all. My what parents the moved to Bowerstone, but I never really liked it there. Uh, are you all right? Her head is switching. It's like a horror movie. I think movie. I lost you there for a second. Anyway, I have to go now. But it was great to see you again. Bye. Thy nameless person. Oh god, you're not the guy who sells me candy. Oh yeah, no, that could, that dude's long gone. Oh. I'll be right there. Over here. I got okay, Maze. If you're gonna keep talking to me, and my own personal head cannon, the guy that sold ch uh, chocolate to a child is the first to die in the bandit raid. Ah, fair enough. Over here. He should have just gave me the, ch the chocolate for free. What a dick. Ah, there you are. Uh, I thought maybe you were getting too famous to be seen round here. I'm not too famous. I I'm have England I've heard my nothing ass. more of your sister. And there's little else I can do. Oh. There is hope yet, though. A blind seeress lives among Twinblade's bandit clan. She may be able to tell you about your sister. Okay. The seeress stands next to the bandit king himself. And it's no coincidence the bandits have been doing so well lately. Have you heard of Twinblade? Nope. He was a hero once. Yes, giant of a man. He had little patience for the guild, though. He left and brought together a dozen bandit factions. I always suspected he was behind the attack on your home. This could be your chance for revenge. Why don't you ever look at me? The camp can't be far from here. The village is often under attack. I've left a quest card at the guild with the details. It's kind of dumb Check that they like make place. you run back to the guild so that you can accept a quest to come back to this place right away. It's that, like, is, that is pretty dumb. Why not just hand me the guild card if you want me to do it, man? Why do you have to make it so difficult? Okay, so down here I go talk to some dude and he gives me stuff. Not quite. Not quite. Talk, to, talk to that guy. Talk to that guy. Oh, this guy. Okay. So it's, it wasn't the guy over there. Well, that's part of it. Oh. Oh, a hero! I could really use your help, sir. <laughs> I love your voice. I run a harmless little chicken contest oh, God. on the beach, but I'm having a bit of ghost trouble. So you want me to kick your chickens? Some deceased chicken fancier, no doubt. The thing is, he's scaring all my punters away. You couldn't, you know, work some of your hero magic and get rid of him, could you? What do you think, boss? What? Should we should we kick should we get rid of some ghosts and save some chickens or kill some chickens? You should. Okay. Yeah. Because the reward for that ghost thing is actually quite good. Is it the uh, um, 
more crunchy Ooh, chickens than we did at Orange? No. No. We guys continue to feed crunchy chickens to Adore. I and you have to feed crunchy chickens to yourself to open the door. Oh, that's right. I have to eat the crunchy chickens for Yeah, okay. Wow. You have to prove that you're evil. Hello. Ah. <laughs> at long last, a kind soul who doesn't flee at the sight of me. Hello. I have paced this forsaken beach for so many years. Could it be that you be sent by the gods to lift me from my fierce torment? Is it good or bad to save him? Uh, good. Okay, so, oh, alright, so I'm trying to get rid of him, okay. My spirit yep. dwells at the bottom of the sea. Arr, and my poor wife is left a destitute and a grieving. Arr. You're a pirate. She thinks I was but a simple fisherman and still be somewhere lost at sea. It may shock you to learn, dear friend, that I had a small <laughs> side business. No, it doesn't piracy. shock you at all. Because you going, Arr. I hid my sinfully plundered treasure next to the jet. Look at that booty. Beach. Oh, my booty's fantastic. If you want to use a spade to dig it up and give it my wife, I will reward you with plentiful riches, ye old sea dog. I don't got a spade. If you be in need of a spade, they be sold in town. Now, okay, go into this house on the right. Okay. So here you can use that little cot as a free place to sleep. Cool. And then obviously there's the chest. Cool. Yay, money. Yeah, I'm just gonna sell that. It's not very good. You got rid of that ghost yet? Shut up, man. Okay. Yeah, dude, that he, every time you pass him, he asks that question until you actually do the quest. It's annoying. Can we go All right. To the um, so, the shops and things haven't opened yet, you so you need to go buy a spade. It's going to take a little bit, though. Don't hire him. He's just going to cost you money. Okay. All of these places are locked. You don't have the lockpick skill. Don't do it. Put your weapon away. Ah, oh, shit! I was trying to put it away! You're gonna get in trouble. How do I put it away? Oh, I don't know how to put it away! <laughs> hey. uh, um, you guys, nobody saw this! Uh, how do I put it away? Mash, bu mash buttons until you put it away. You uh, got rid of that ghost yet? No! Working on it! That's not a... Uh, uh, no, that's supposed to pull out! Shoots a bow! What's that, bounty? Yep. <laughs> ah, bollocks. Uh, uh, okay. What was it? Okay, I figured it out. Put things away. You... And, and... You keep quiet. Now you've got a bounty on you. Then you either have to pay, or fight, or run away. Well, I need a spade, so we'll deal with it. Not a spade. You just pay them 250 gold. I don't have 250 gold. Maybe I do. You have 5,000. Oh. That's it. I'm off. There you go. I paid you off. No, I'm not going to sponsor you after you robbed me, you dickbag. Frickin' constable dickbag. Hey. Sorry about breaking your door in. I'm not sorry. Where's the place that sells spades. So in the middle of the map, you see those two things that are yellow and purple? Ah, oh, those shops. And they're not open yet. I do have an axe. I have done this before. Have you seen my rap sheet? Seven fucking miles wide. Hi! You're bald. Do you sell shovels? Oh no, you sell armor. I'm in the armor shop. I feel silly. You don't sell he shovels has, at all. He has plate armor. Any laws. You don't go breaking any laws. Oh, yes, plate armor. Let's see what I can buy from you. Hi. You don't go breaking my heart. I'm don't go breaking my laws. I, I couldn't if I tried. I don't know how to buy things you anymore. Restless. Dave's. Who's Dave? I don't and know. Why do you have? Why do you have Dave's hat? A man called Dave was once wandering around Albion with boxes. Is this a Minecraft joke? But I Fable came out before that. What's really weird about this game is they've got plate boots, plate gloves, plate legs, plate chest. 
but they don't have a plate helmet. No, oh, they got a chainmail helmet. Yeah, that's that's the highest armor rating helmet that you can get in the game. Yesterday, I'm putting it on because it looks spiffy. I think it'll make my pants stick out even better, you know? <laughs> so I just want to be like real fashionable with my pantslessness. Is that so? Yeah. I'm. Oh my god, I'm beautiful. Oh! Oh, dude, my monkey's <laughs> on my back. Uh huh. I think I actually have more armor now than I did before. Because this, I think this yeah. helmet is worth more than uh that thing I took off. You, you're right, actually. Excellent. All right, now I gotta go buy a spade. Hello, I'm here to purchase spade. Hey, don't walk away. What can I do you for? You're sure to find something to suit you. You're sure to find something to shoot? I found a helmet. Well, why would I need chocolates or a wedding ring? I'm not getting married. I'm busy. Do you not spell spade? Oh, there's spade. I'll run up to it and press A, I believe. It'd be right next to the jetty on the western beach wheel. Okay, there's a jetty in the western beach. So the western beach is um, on the left side of the screen there. Yep, I see it. I was trying to kick that chicken. You got rid of that ghost I swear, man, I will take this prostitute and I will make you die. I don't know how that works. Do I like pick her up like a great club and just boom? Have you ever seen the movie Hancock? Hello. That I believe is the, I the stand pirate out here and look oh. out to sea. My dear husband was lost to the waters years ago. He went on a fishing expedition and never came What's back. What's an expedition? Was it I expert? I haven't given up hope. It's a jetty. Look. It's like a little. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what a jetty is. I thought it was like a little thing that like sticks off. Assassin boots. Those aren't big and clumpy like my boots I'm wearing. I don't want them. I'm not an assassin. I'm a knight. Can't you see my armor? <laughs> why, why, why I'm an English come? royal knight, and I will not be treated like a common peasant. Oh, wait. You're an ass assassin. Um, all right, so it's, I think it might be on the Hi far there. end of that side there. Yeah, it's yeah. gotta be around here. Um. Nope, can't as far go that as you way. can go, you can fish there. Um, to the left. I think it might be right next to the dock. Might be like tucked in around here. Yep, there it is. Oh man, that clip shovel is amazing. All right. uh, and then it's 500 gold that the pirate left for his wife. Now you can keep that. Um, Have a pleasant visit, sir. But you don't get the other reward, I believe. Well, I already uh, paid 250 gold to the guard to stop chasing my butt, so I'm gonna give sad oh, person the wife. I, I mean, give sad wife the gold. More. Hi! You can have this. <gasps> oh my goodness. This is from my husband! He's dead. You say he saved I don't know how she figured Thomas that out. out but... on his boat. Well, yes, no, I, I think I the game's assuming that you told her on board, because you're a silent hero. But they looked like it's from a distance. Isn't that silly? I knew he really cared for me. He was such a good, honest man. No, he wasn't. He was a horrible Thank murdering so pirate. Much. I will still pray to see him return safe one day. Even if he didn't murder right people, he was a pirate, which means shopping. he stole stuff. Mm -hmm. So he's either like a, a at the he, at the very minimum, very minimum, he's a petty thief. Yeah, also... At the maximum, he's, you know, grand larceny and murder. Yeah, that, that shit's probably stolen from some merchant who got his neck slit, okay? So, good enough... What? It's magic. Oh. It's Dave. Dave. You have Dave? A nice day. Dave's gone. Aww. Dave died. Well, shame for Dave. Maybe if Dave... Right, now you gotta, you gotta go back to the sure. ghost. Oh, that's right. I gotta go back to him. That's because... I just dug shit up and said I'm putting it in You've been a trusty sea dog, yeah. Gotcha. Uh, perchance now I can finally enjoy my dad. But before I leave, I shall keep my end of the bargain. Arr! The rest of the swag be buried under the axe of a statue in the local graveyard. If it still be there, you're welcome to it. Now, thank ye, and goodbye. Okay, so, so he's leaving now. We got, we yes, got he's, he's done. 
he's done. And now you can talk to the chicken kicking dude and get him to shut up finally. You got rid of that ghost? Hello there. Yes, I got rid of the ghost, you dick. Have you got rid of him yet? No. You have? Why, Capital News. Come down and pay me and the oh, chickens guys, a visit. Oh, guys, a newsie. Boston in? Boston. So all, a lot of the graves in the graveyard have stuff buried in them that you can grab. I just got the 500 gold back. Mm-hmm. Excellent. I'm going to be a grave digger because that's not morally corrupt or bankrupt. I won't be bankrupt because we could bankrupt in some graves. Hi, home. You can't be bankrupt as a grave robber. Tough. I'm going to dig here. What did you give me? Something good? Oh. Ooh. Yeah, it's actually a pretty good weapon. The problem, though, is that it's a great axe, which means you probably don't have the strength to wield it yet, so it's going to be very, very slow. Oh. You can pull your weapon out here without getting in trouble, by the way. Yeah. It's... Oh, maybe not. You're good. Yeah, remember I've been doing nothing but beefing myself up? Yeah. Because I want to be buff bod boy. And I feel right like a, you know, 1700 Englishman. I find people's graves, I loot them, I find gold, I loot it. I find your country, I plant my flag, no flag, no country. You know, proper Englishman. This gargoyle kind of looks like he's like trying to break a move. He's like, cool, look at my skills. And the other gar gargoyle's like, dude, I don't, we're, I don't, I'm not associating with the party. Yeah, he's like, dude, you're embarrassing me. Yeah, I'm just, dude, just stop. I'm just, I'm, I'm just going to go chill on the wall. I don't know this guy.